the snow started falling hard after the morning commute, and it is expected to keep falling on and off all day. News 13's Francesca Washington is live near I-40 in Tramway with a look at what's happening in the metro. Kim, the snow flurries have slowed down a lot since we got out here on the road around 10 this morning. Now, the east side and downtown, they saw the worst of it. Now, this weather isn't keeping people off the road in the metro. We caught up with a lot of people out running errands, some people fishing in Tingley, and even a runner in the Bosque. They tell us the roads have been manageable so far. Slow traffic. Everybody's been trying to keep in their own lanes and not speeding. So, that's the plus side. The city of Albuquerque says they have crews out monitoring the roads. They're focused on the Northeast Heights because that's where they're seeing the most accumulation. Department of Transportation crews have been out since 4 this morning monitoring the roads, and a spokesperson tells us they plan to keep them out if the road conditions do get worse. Kim, back to you. Thanks, Francesca. Now, the snow is hitting much of the state. That includes, if you can believe it, the Roswell area. This is video of the city that is usually one of the hottest in the state. As you can see, there is a little bit of accumulation there. Also, Portales got hit. So, Eastern New Mexico University closed at 11 o'clock because of the snow. Now, one of the areas who got hit hard is Santa Fe. That came at the worst possible time when many people were heading up to work and the legislative session. This is video near La Cienega. The snow does continue to come down here and there. There is a good coating outside the roundhouse. Now, some businesses, schools, and courts across the state are closing early. We will be posting that on our website throughout the day.